Hey everybody, welcome to Circle of the Blind Mice, where we are low on vision but high on tech. Back again with another video, and today I have a quick tip video on how to use the new Facebook reactions on your iOS device. And I'm going to show you how to do this both with and without voiceover on. So I'm doing this on my iPad Air 2. And first I'm gonna show you just real quick how to do it while voiceover is off. So basically what you do, for those of you who are partially sighted and able to navigate without voiceover, is just simply tap and hold the like button like you normally would have done. This will bring up a menu with six icons, like, love, ha ha, wow, sad, and angry. Simply select the option you want to choose and you're done. Now, if you made a mistake, simply tap the, what would normally be the like button again, and that will remove your reaction. Now I'm going to show you how to do it with voiceover on. So I'll just turn voiceover on. Voiceover on. Landscape. Home button to the right. So with voiceover on, first you're going to single tap the item that you want to react to. So it could be a picture, it could be a story, whatever it may be. So in this case, I am tapping on a picture. Once you've selected the item you want to react to, simply double tap it with two fingers. This will bring up the reactions menu. To scroll through the menu, simply swipe from right to left on your screen to go through the various options. So we're going to select react by double tapping on our screen. This then brings up the reaction options. So simply, so simply select the option you want and double tap with one finger anywhere on your screen. And there you go, you're done. Now, if you selected an option by mistake and you want to reverse it, simply single tap on the item or story that you want to react to or change. Then double tap on your screen with two fingers. This then brings up the reactions menu, except for now you'll have an option to remove your selected reaction or change your reactions. So I'm going to remove my reaction. And there you go. That's all there is to it. Some of you might be wondering, where is the dislike button? Facebook purposely left the dislike button out to prevent bullying, which I think is an excellent decision. As someone who was bullied myself growing up due to my visual impairment, I'm all for prevention. So I think that goes a long way. But uh, what do you think? Tell me in the comments below. Do you think they should have included the dislike button? Is, are there other emotions or reactions you think that they should have included? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for sticking around to the end of this video. Here at Circle of the Blind Mice, I bring you these videos because I believe technology enriches the lives of those of us with visual impairments. My mission is to help you learn tech, use tech, and embrace tech. Please like and share this video to help spread the word to your fellow blind mice. And if you're new here, please subscribe for new videos every Wednesday. Thanks for watching.